hello. Of course, I don't, as soon as I started. Um, because we are all anticipating the release of the book, Hi Cordelia, Cordelia, because you can get the doll right now. You can totally get the doll right now, but right now you cannot buy the book. We're waiting with bated breath for it to go online. So I figured that while we're all waiting, for our little redheaded girl to become available in book form, I was going to go ahead and do a reading for you guys and I'll put it up on YouTube. You may use this video um, with Facebook parties. You can share it on Facebook. You can share it far and wide. You are allowed. You have my permission. Because I find that when you share things freely, it helps sales. Some people think the opposite. Totally helps sales. So, you can use this. Let me make sure my phone's turned off. Uh, okay. Cordelia. Still don't have it quite memorized, so I might I might have to turn back and forth a little bit. The girl, look at Cordelia. I'll make sure you get to see the pages because I know there's some people here that have not seen the book yet. Cordelia could fly along with the breeze. What seemed impossible, she did with ease. There she goes, flying off the page. The deeper her courage and confidence grew, the higher she went, the higher she flew. From the top of her head to the tips of her toes, the more she believed, the more that she rose. Cordelia could fly. She always just knew. This faith in herself was how it was true. When she trusted her heart and trusted it whole, she could sing with the birds songs filling her soul. I'm wearing Cordelia red for this. Can you tell? Mm -hmm. Red's my color this year. From up overhead, the earth sparkled and gleamed. A world filled with friends, with magic and dreams. Look at her, all her awesome friends. Oh, that's a whale tail. That's a whale tail. Up in the sky, she would make the moon smile, dance with the stars, and laugh all the while. Cordelia's world was vivid, colored, and bright. Joy filled her days. Beauty filled her nights. That's one of my favorite spreads. I love that one. Her happiness was endless. Her delight only grew. Until the day others doubted she flew. They didn't see her sing and play. They didn't see her fly. No one would believe her. They didn't even try. She used lots of ways, as many as she could find, to explain what was possible. But no one changed their mind. No one seemed to listen. No one seemed to care when Cordelia explained how she flew up in the air. They said that she was silly. They said that she was wrong. They made Cordelia doubt who she'd been all along. As their words filled her head, her heart began to sink. Does who you are depend on what other people think? So Cordelia stopped doing the thing that she loved, the thing that made her happy, that made her who she was. She didn't fly and sing with the birds in the trees, no twirling, spinning, smiling, no gliding on the breeze. She didn't wish good morning to the whale and salty air as the sun warmed her skin and the wind blew her hair. She didn't visit the moon to try to make him grin or play games with the stars, seeing who would win. Cordelia began to walk in an ordinary way like everybody else on an ordinary day. As the days passed, Cordelia stayed on the ground. Life became gray. There was no color. There was no sound. She missed the stars and moon. She missed the bird's sweet song. She missed the mighty whale. Everything was wrong. As she thought about her friends, her sadness became anger. She was mad at herself for letting other people change her. Who was anyone to say if she could or couldn't fly, what was or wasn't possible if they 
didn't even try. She got mad. With confidence and strength, Cordelia began anew. She was the girl who could fly, and she knew this was true. As Cordelia ran along, a feeling began to start. It was a soothing of her soul, a healing in her heart. She remembered who she was, and that she loved to fly. As the doubts of others fell away, she rose up in the sky. Cordelia began to fly again, to sing and play and soar, because what others thought didn't matter anymore. She knew just who she was. She knew who she could be. And this belief in herself set Cordelia free. Just because another can't see this world like you doesn't make things impossible or mean they aren't true. That's Beatrice! Beatrice the whale! Oh, the little star says goodbye! All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed that reading of Cordelia. I don't want to make this video too long, so you can use it for things. Share it, share it, share it, and then sell it, sell it, sell it. Don't worry, we'll make more if we sell out. It'll be awesome. All right, bye, guys. Thank you. Mwah. 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 <laughs> bye, guys.